<sighs> this isn't the foe we can overcome, Kakarot! We can at least try! <laughs> 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 He was talking about Super Saiyan God earlier! What of it? I think I'm bigger something out. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Are you through wasting my time? Ground for the Super Saiyan God! Well, I'll get rid of this Forsaken Planet. Wait! We can use the Dragon Balls! Shenron surely knows of a Super Saiyan God! Wait for us to summon forth the Dragon! And you'll get what you want. Fine. This better work. Finally got those damn groceries! And, uh, uh what's she want? Hello? How long does it take to do simple groceries? And why are you walking when you can fly? Maybe because I want to get away from you for as long as possible! <laughs> I'll call you back. <laughs> Stay your business! Your appearance! And the tail! I know that all lower class warriors almost look the same, but your resemblance to Kakarot is uncanny! You're not far off, Vegeta. I'm actually looking for Goku, the Super Saiyan God. Care to lead me to him so I won't have to warm up on you? Kakarot? A Super Saiyan God? I think you've got it all wrong. You're quite the comedian, Vegeta. I've made up my mind. You're going to be the warm up before I face Son Goku! <laughs> <laughs> You scum! For starting on the wrong foot, you're making me bother with things I dislike. I'm flabbergasted, Vegeta! Oh, you are strong! No! Could it possibly be that you're stronger than the Goku of this timeline? Who knows? <laughs> now explain to me why there's another saying around. You're in no position to alter me around. <laughs> I won't lose to the likes of you. I still have to beat Trunks and the CEO of the main timeline. <laughs> I'll use you as a means of getting stronger. <laughs> What's so funny, Vegeta? Timeline? Trunks? Elaborate this instant clown! <laughs> it's simple. I already traveled to a parallel world like this one. And each time I was at the brink of death. I recovered and grew exponentially stronger. I was ready. Or so I thought. Just when I thought I was strong enough to ensure no failure, I did not expect Goku and you, Vegeta, to make an appearance. You managed to steal off my ally who was immortal. In case of things went dire, we proposed fusion, but that was no longer an option. My plan failed. And I found myself surrounded in a most disastrous situation. My ally was defeated because he was weak. I was wrong to underestimate you Saiyans. I knew that this is where I'll meet my end. That everything I did was for naught. I stood no chance against the three of you. I could have sworn my mind was blank, but before I was done for, I recalled this ring I wear, and escaped the very face of death. I didn't even realize what happened until only afterwards. I escaped to another timeline where I couldn't be traced. And now I need to ensure I won't be defeated ever again. Tough luck! You're not getting out of this alive! On the contrary! You cannot even fathom my power! Yeah! 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 Yeah!
So it's just as I speculated. Worry not, Vegeta. I will match your Super Saiyan God with death. <laughs> 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 You stole his body, yet you're nothing compared to him! Is that your true power? Cutter me disappointed. Rot in hell! <laughs> Surely you've noticed that my base power is much stronger than it was compared to when we started this fight. I don't even need the Kaioken anymore! <laughs> Vegeta, do you know why it's impossible for Goku to combine Super Saiyan and the Kaioken together? It's because using them together is lethal for the body. You see, the emotional turmoil of the Super Saiyan form would not allow the precise key control to survive the Kaioken. Which is why Goku succeeded doing so only in the other world. But I managed to bypass the lethality. But before I explain, I prelude. My counterpart, who did not seek a Saiyan body like I did, retained his godly abilities and thus healed my wounds any time I was at death's door. That way, we successfully exploited the Saiyan's ability to make significant jumps in power. But my counterpart is long gone. So I had to come up with an alternate way to get power-ups. When I took over this body, I lost my godly abilities. Thankfully, I managed to relearn how to utilize healing to an extent. I trained my body to withstand the strain of using Super Saiyan and Kaioken together, and though one could die from combining both by using them together for short bursts to break my body down and afterwards heal time after time, not only have I minimized the drawbacks altogether, I still exploit the Saiyan's ability to power up from this process. But this only works if I endure a great struggle in actual combat and you've been serving your part well. Do you realize what I'm saying, Vegeta? Since this fight began, I've been feeding off Zenkai boosts. It's only a matter of time before I outpower you even like this. You won't live long enough for it. <laughs> What's this? This is the true form of the Saiyan, Vegeta. I figured that if I want to fully adjust the Saiyan body, then all I need to do battle I'm like this. In terms of pure power, such form pales in comparison to Super Saiyan God. <laughs> I couldn't agree more. Which is why beating you like this will be all the more satisfying. Let me tell you on a secret, Vegeta. 
I sought a form like this on purpose. I stumbled upon a certain timeline that showcased deeper understanding of Saiyan folklore. And from observing said timeline, I went into the wilderness to use the Saiyan body more efficiently. I've come to learn that the tail is crucial to the Saiyan body, and if one assumes the great ape form while being a Super Saiyan, and then proceeds to regain full control, one can advance from a Super Saiyan form like no other. After countless attempts, I succeeded in pulling it off. You see, Vegeta, I knew that if I get full understanding of you feral Saiyans, then no one could stop me. I can end this battle whenever I want, Vegeta. But I need to get stronger from all this. So cooperate while you're still alive. Ha! Master. <laughs> Construct made out of key? What's happening? <laughs> In the end, even with Super Saiyan God, you're nothing! You piece of trash! You think you can win because of one lucky hit? Sorry, State. You can't win. Every day of my life. I trained every day of my life to get to where I am now. Unlike you, who simply stole his fruits of training. Your very existence sickens me. All the strength we forged in a lifetime, in some future you took in an instant by taking the shortcut. Losing to you means losing all that made me what I am! Oh, well, I didn't know an evolution of Super Saiyan God existed. You keep surprising me, Vegeta. You made a grave mistake pushing me to a corner. We Saiyans break our limits time after time in situations like these. I'm glad. It wouldn't be a real match otherwise! <laughs> Galaxy! This is nothing! Nothing you say, you're finished! <laughs> you say an imposter! I'm starting to realize the weakness of that form of yours. You had me worried for a second. Had I not given my all, I'd suffice lethal damage. This is a very fortunate turn of events! I figured it out! What?! I'm glad I was wrong about you, Vegeta, to push me this far! Delicious bastard! You 
prove to be a decent punching bag after all! A punching bag? Don't make me laugh. I finally cut it! You're just a fake. That's why a true Saiyan won't ever be beaten! By an imposter like you! Be gone! So what if you cut off my tail? Such a fool you are! You've been playing right into my hands! Without that tail, you've been robbed of that form of yours! Move a muscle and you're a dead man! <coughs> I'll admit this, Vegeta. I did not expect you to undergo such a drastic change in power, but that proves for the best. Because you see, if I managed to heal from the way I am now, then this trip was all the more worth it! <laughs> of this pressure! A combination of Super Saiyan and Super Saiyan God! I told you I could end this battle whenever I wanted. But the way I am now, if you get near me, I'm dead. And I need to get stronger from this near-death experience. You should have cut my arm before my tail. In the end, I'll get that Zenkai I wanted. I thank you, Vegeta! By the time I recover! I'll become much stronger. Hey everyone, Steampunk Jones here. I just want to say thank you so much for watching this fan dub. We've had a whole lot of fun doing this one in particular. Thank you so much for watching. Um, misconception, I don't play Goku, so stop commenting. Jones, good Goku, oh my goodness. I don't play Goku. Read the description, you'll see who everyone plays. And, uh, you know, like, comment, share, all, all the good stuff. And stay tuned for the next one. Thank you. <sighs> it's over for you! It's time to rid this world of you, disgusting Saiyan! <laughs> there it is. I finally got to that certain timeline again. <laughs>